Also breaking a guilty plea and a no holds barred apology from former state senator Martin Sandoval. He's now facing serious prison time for taking bribes and filing a false tax return. CBS2 political investigator Dana Kosloff was there when Sandoval walked up to cameras and said, I'm sorry. Earlier today, I pled guilty to crimes I committed as a state senator. And then the ex state lawmaker apologized to his constituents and the people of Illinois. Sandoval confessed to taking $250,000 in bribes, much of it to protect and help enhance profits for one Chicago based red light camera company. Again, I am deeply ashamed of my actions. Take full responsibility. Sandoval didn't take questions, but his plea agreement lays out details of his admitted crimes. They center on campaign contributions and so called consulting fees given to him by CW1, a person with an interest in that red light camera company. Those payments began in 2016 and ended in 2019, totaling $70,000. Federal prosecutors say the rest of the bribe money came from other corrupt activities tied to Sandoval's position position in the state Senate. As part of that plea agreement, Mr. Sandoval has agreed to fully and truthfully cooperate with the government, with the U.S. Attorney's Office in any matter that we ask him to cooperate on. Sandoval could be facing 10 years or more in prison, but his cooperation could be a factor in his sentencing, which will take place later this year at 6. I'll have more details on his specific crimes and on that specific red light camera company. In the control room, Dana Kozlov, CBS 2 News.